that together, albeit over a, a four-round contest, then there will be fireworks. And straight from the off, Sashinsky's trying to show... Remember, he's six foot three. Oh! I don't think there's any real damage done, but he, but he was down, square balance, and down for the first time in the opening seconds. Well, he's going looking for him now, Sashinsky. Doesn't produce a cut from either of them the way that Shashinsky's coming looking forward, for that big right hand again. Shashinsky and he lands it. Can Juni get there? But look at Juni now. He's showing that he's got some power also, John. Shashinsky again leaning on and trying to show that he's the strong man. Shashinsky's coming forward again now, finding the target, but both boxers are taking massive risks here, John. He's just staggered again, there was uh, Junior. And better shots from Junior now, he seems to have weathered the storm, John. Sashinsky trying to finish the round as the aggressor, last few seconds. Well, we said that it could be... A look here, Sashinsky coming forward, and it's just a jab, isn't it? Just a straight jab, just above a perfect punch. Steps in, chin down, straight jab on the button, cracking shot. That's a lovely uppercut, beautiful shot. Yeah, put a good shot to get from Junior. Closing that gap down, but that's suiting Junior. He doesn't have to go looking for him, oh, but walking onto the odd big shot here and there. Some of these big swings that Sashinsky's trying to fire in. It's coming in from somewhere around about the third row. Quieting down a little bit, but again, Sashinsky just keeps coming forward. But there's that left uppercut, just gets caught as he's trying to throw it, Junior. Sashinsky having nothing like the success that he did in the opening three minutes. And Alois Junior, this 18-year-old from South London, finishes on the attack and has probably taken that round. Sashinsky's upped his work rate here, though, in the third. He's strong, a little bit of a nick now, below the left eye of Sashinsky. Yeah, this Polish lad. Good body shot again from Junior. Yeah, but Sashinsky's the aggressor now. Sashinsky just keeps coming forward. He can still fancies it on that front foot coming forward. His opponent down. What a tough fight this is, and for him to take this at 24 hours' notice, it's quite incredible. And the performance he's putting in here against a real strong, unbeaten opponent. His young fighter, Alois Jr., he said he doesn't really give a damn. Big punches going in from both boxers. Oh, great uppercut inside from Jr. And now he's holding on, wanting to buy a few seconds. There it is again, that left up a cup, we spoke about it earlier, that's the point. Cracking contest, just over a minute to go. And again, this round is pretty close, and Judy now starting to land the better shots. Is Sashinsky now starting to tire a little bit more? As well, well, last few seconds for the purists, but I tell you what, it's been enthralling nevertheless. These two guys have given it absolutely everything. And whatever applause they're given, and whatever congratulations they give each other, it is so richly, richly deserved. To your winner, from Lublin, Poland,